Today we have another haircutting tutorial. In today's tutorial, you're only going to need a few things. Clippers. Now with these clippers, the attachments that I chose to use were a number one, a number two, and a number four. In addition to the clippers, beard struggle scissors, and beard struggle beard balm is what I am going to be using in my hair today as far as product. All right, I think that's pretty much it. Oh wait, and a mirror. First things first, I'm going to start up top and today's cut is going to be a bit more drastic than it usually is. I want to go for a super clean, not necessarily buzz, maybe about an inch and a half to two inches up top and we're going to do a one across the bottom and a two and kind of gradually fade into the top. Clippers, again, don't be scared. And we're just gonna get right to it. And I am just going all the way around and taking, I'm just gonna start taking it off up until I like the length on top. Now that I'm finished cutting the top of my hair, I'm gonna go ahead and take a number four and pretty much set the tone for how I'm going to fade my hair. So I'm gonna go up all the way because this is gonna be the longest part of the fade and I want it to go into the top of my hair so it's not a complete disconnect. Here's what I'm talking about. Okay, so now we're going to place the headband on where I want the fade to stop. I want to go more aggressive, so I think I'm going to drop down to a one. one. Oh, definitely a lot more of a difference. Okay, now that we are done with the one at its longest length up top, we're going to go ahead and take the band off. And now um, I've placed a number two, and the number two, again, it's going to be at the longest length. And I'm just going to go ahead and fade up just, just by feel. And you're more or less, you're still tracing the line, but you're just gradually going up. Now doing this will reduce the contrast so there isn't as aggressive as a disconnect but it's still fairly aggressive Alrighty, now that we've done the two at the longest length i'm going to go ahead and put a four on for half an inch or 13 millimeters. And I'm gonna put the four at the shortest length by cranking this up so it's gonna bring it back. And I'm gonna go ahead and continue to go a little higher on my fade up into the main length of my hair to continue more of the, the fade, gradual fade. Alrighty, now that we've finished up with the four, going around the crown of the main hair, and we've already done the fade, I think we're pretty much set to rinse off, style the hair, and then see what we're working at. It should be good. Again, it was a one on the shortest level, and then I did a two across the top right here, and then I took the four, 
and I just went through and kind of blended it in with the length on top of my hair. The only thing that I can see that I might be doing is maybe um, cutting my bangs a tad bit shorter. That's pretty much it. So I'm gonna head over to the shower and then I'll be right back. Alrighty, so we have jumped out of the shower and now I'm gonna go ahead, put some product on my hair and style it. Now as far as product, I mean with me it's two birds and one stone or two birds with one stone. Um, I use my beard balm for my hair. I like the matte finish and it smells pretty good too. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this and it, again, the beard struggle, beard balm, scorched is the scent that I have been using lately. Here we go. Let me go ahead and put some in my finger. Now again, it, it doesn't take a lot. It's pretty much the size of a dime and it should be good to go. And I just I get messy with it, just twirl it around. And then I just go ahead and style. Kind of mess it up, toss it around a little bit. So definitely options as far as how you can style it. Now as far as the overall look, here it is. Okay, I, I think we're pretty much good to go. If anything, I, I might bring my bangs down a little bit so they're not super out there. Anyways, I hope you found this useful. If you did, give it a thumbs up and maybe even subscribe. Again, I do this for those that don't have the time or you just don't want to waste the money going to a stylist or a barber. So yeah, hope you found this of use. Peace.